first school day uh, rolling around. Lots of kids across East Texas are getting ready to take on the school year. KTRE's Tyree White shows us how to get those digital habits back on track in time for the first spell. As the summer comes to a close, parents may want to start closely watching the amount of time their child spends on digital devices. Children's Clinic of Lufkin pediatrician Dr. Amal Despondi says too much screen time could be keeping them up at night. Kids have been glued to the cell phone, video games, spending easily seven to eight hours a day on screen time. The time spent using social media among eight to 12 year olds is up eight minutes a day from 2019. The top five sites grabbing their attention, Snapchat, Instagram, Facebook, Discord, and Pinterest. The cell phone at night emits white color light, which can trick your brain to think it's a daytime. So a lot of teenagers complain of they have a hard time falling asleep. The solution is simple. So I would recommend all the parents to slowly start trying to go to bed earlier, an hour in few days. That way, closer to the day starts at school, they are getting enough sleep. Something parent Rebecca Grove is already doing. Usually a week before the school starts, then yes, we start implementing that so that way they, they understand that, okay, school's getting ready to start. It's time for me to go back to the old routine. A routine that Grove says helps in the long run. Schoolwork, there's that less distraction of, oh, well, who's texting me? Who's doing this? Who's doing that? It doesn't matter because it's not time for you to be looking at all of that. Tyree White, KTRE, East Texas News 9. Discussing screen time expectations before the school year starts is another way that parents can make sure their kids are practicing healthy digital habits.